they know that they are on demand, on high demand. So they can afford any type of behavior. There are, what do you mean they're on high demand? Well, they are valuable. They are at the good price. In this <laughs> they're valuable and the women are not? Deadbeat dads in Ukraine is the topic of this video. Maria, so first of all, is it true that there are a lot of deadbeat dads in Ukraine? Well, unfortunately, yes, it's true. So. And why do you think that is? I think it's because of um, we have a whole generation of such deaths and uh, we have to deal with it. Why? I cannot tell you. Maybe because of parents. So let me paint the picture. There's a lot of uh, what you're saying, what we're saying is there's a lot of Ukrainian men. They're in a family situation or they have a child and they, they just take off. They leave the family yes. and they don't take care of the child. They don't pay child support yeah. uh, and they just basically abandon the family. Yeah. Well, they just quit uh, this game and they they behave like it's not uh, their problems, it's not their issues, and uh, they don't pay uh, monthly support. They are not involved in children's lives. So, and and even the legal uh, child support level in Ukraine is fifty dollars a month per yes, child, right? Yes, the minimum uh, amount is fifty dollars. It's a measly fifty dollars, and even at that, they avoid, they yeah. dodge it. Yes, they, they show uh, different uh, reasons that they cannot pay this month of support and they just uh, hide from from these uh, payments. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they hide from, the, they shirk their responsibility. And why do you think, you know, why do you think it is? Do you think uh, the fact that there's a very, I mean, there's no legal deterrent really. Is it? Like there's no, if a guy doesn't pay his child support, mm -hmm. what happens to him? What does the law do to him if a father doesn't pay his child support? Well, there is no actually working system which can uh, stop such behavior. Now we can, we have such law which uh, um, forbids to leave the country to, to go abroad if you don't pay uh, this minimum support. But it actually doesn't work, correct? So you can avoid it anyway. Yeah, the bottom line is there's a lot of dads that don't pay and uh, guys, uh, it's good for you to know this because um, ladies uh, here, they, they will say one of their top criteria for a guy, what they look for is a responsible man, right? Yes. And because they're tired of this kind of irresponsible behavior for the, the husbands and the, and the fathers. Well, we're tired of uh, not uh, responsible behavior. We're tired that they don't, don't even want to invo be involved in lives, in children's lives. And, uh, do you think maybe another reason, like, do you think uh, Ukrainian men are spoiled? Do they have too much option for beautiful women? So they just leave the, the mother of the child and go get a, another beautiful younger woman or what? Well, they are spoiled and they were raised without, no, uh, without family values and attitude and they're not grateful. So the women have family values, traditional family values, but the men don't? Is that what I'm understanding? Well, yes, because they know that they are on demand, on high demand. So they can afford any type of behavior. They're, what do you mean they're on high demand? Well, they are valuable. They are at the good price. In this <laughs> they're country. valuable and the women are not? Or? Well, yes, because it's much uh, more women here than men. So that's why. So the men, the Ukrainian men are... Uh, a, a diamond, as you were saying, yeah. they 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 uh, think of themselves as the diamond. Their value is higher than the woman. That's the way they perceive it. They self self esteem is much higher and stronger than the women's. So they think if well, if this woman doesn't like me, she doesn't like my drinking or this habit or that habit or whatever, I'll just uh, fine. I'll go yes. get myself another one. Yes, that's right. So guys, uh, we're just telling you straight up the way it is here, and the reason it's good for you to know is because you know. Uh, one reason why Ukrainian ladies are looking now for foreign men, right? They're looking, they're hoping something yeah. better, right? Well, actually, Ukrainian women spoil our men too, because we are all gorgeous and feminine and uh, glam looking. So, we, they and have tolerant, a tolerant. Yes, yes, and that's why they uh, they have a great variety of women. Mm -hmm. And we were saying in another video that women are even expecting him to be a, a cheating man and they yes. tolerate it yes that's right uh -huh. yep I've heard this before that um, <laughs> they have spoiled the men so mm -hmm. thanks uh, for enlightening us on Thank this you. topic and guys if you haven't seen the rest of uh, Maria and I's videos they're in the description below even Maria has a friend uh, she admitted it is a gold digger milk guys you guys out of 200 grand 
And uh, we did a video called the top five red flags that you might be dating a gold digger. You definitely don't want to miss that. It's in the description below. Good luck, guys, on your journey looking for love. Thanks, Maria. Thank you.